Okay, once again, I got this awesome beet, and I'm going to be looking for some paper-thin slices. It's a little tricky because this baby's quite slippery. Mm -hmm. uh, what I'm going to do is give it a flat spot. Now I can give it some thin slices much, much easier. Okay, we're going to go get a nice flat spot to start with. Here we go. Okay, I got a few slices here, and now uh, I've got my cutter set. I'm going to do a couple of small cuts here with the cutter set on these beets. Okay, that's the first cut. Pretty cool. It's kind of an egg size cut egg shape. Let's do one more of those. Okay. One, two, three. And now I'm going to switch to a smaller cutter. This little one here. Just do a couple more. Two, three. Really nice. These are beautiful. Give you a close up of these babies here. Uh huh. All right, I'm going to do a couple more. I like this shape, the size, and everything. Very nice. Please make sure you click that subscribe button so you're following and catching our new videos whenever they come out. Right there, one, two, three. Okay, so now I'm going to look at that pickled egg. Okay, pickled egg. And we're going to cut that baby in perfect half. Nice. And uh, I'm going to make a quick appetizer here. Okay, so I'm making a quick appetizer here. I've got a base of a little bit of marinated balsamic coleslaw. I'm going to be putting my beets right over here like this. I've got uh, half a pickled egg here, and I've got some of my favorite... Hatch chili powder. Okay. Got another pickled egg here. And I got one of my other favorites, and that is ahi amarillo powder. Just putting a touch on it there. So I got two peppers working right there. Okay. Got these little beets that we did earlier. One, two, three. And I got three more of them right here. Two, three. Okay. Got this beet rose that I tossed together. Put that in the front. I got a little bit of julienne beets right here. Just put a few of these over here like this. That's the video. Please like, share, subscribe, support your sponsor. Keep cooking and have a great day. That's a, a pretty uh, unusual appetizer. And, uh, well, thought you might find it interesting.
we go. Juliana beets. Okay, would look pretty good with appetizer, maybe some sushi. Uh, 